The new Star Citizen Alpha 3.22 patch just dropped into the EPTU. This time around, it's for Wave 3 testers. Okay, so this one is relatively short. Under feature updates, they have gameplay changes as well. It says here increased tractor beam strength for the Reclaimer and Vulture. And they've also done a structural salvage VFX polish pass. Under ships and vehicles, they have adjusted the spring stiffness for hover bikes. And under weapons and items, they've updated the R97 shotgun to an ammo count of 18. Before we move forward, I'd like y'all to know that the channel goal is to hit 10,000 subscribers by the end of this month, and I cannot do it without you guys. If you do watch content from this channel regularly, please do me a favor and subscribe. Alright, moving on to bug fixes here. They fixed an issue causing enemy ships not to spawn in unless the player is within 12 kilometers of them. Should be more than 20k now. They fixed an issue causing the vehicles to stream out at a much shorter distance than intended. They fixed multiple replace me balls around the derelict settlement. They also fixed an issue where the grunt AI do not spawn. This is pertaining to the derelict settlement locations. They also fixed an issue causing lower than intended client performance around Hurston's Ocean. They also fixed an issue where RMC and construction components were not able to be sold at Orison Admin or TDD. So this is a good one. I've never been able to sell anything thus far, so this is good. Um, they also fixed an issue where Master Mode's compatible shipped engines cannot be powered on with Master Mode. They fixed an issue pertaining to the Reclaimer where damaged UVs are not present on the Reclaimer Claw after taking damage. They also fixed an issue where Copper Glass is too dark. This is for the Argo SRV. And they fixed an issue where you're unable to open inventory after quick buying a consumable. They fixed an issue where the STVE emissions emitted by vehicles should no longer be far too high. And they fixed an issue where little squares appear when changing keybinds with modifier. So now this is the keybinds uh, menu options here. Along with this is two client crashes, one server crash. And just to let y'all know my organization phase one industries is recruiting new and veteran players. If you're interested, you can find our Discord in the description down below. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe. I'll see you on the next video.